Hello boys and girls, I have a fun seed lesson you can try at home. Now this one we may have to come back and look at um, over a couple different days. Um, so we're gonna do something fun with us and see how the seeds grow and what happens from these seeds. So it takes a couple days, but you can try it at home if you want. Um, if mom and dad have any type of seeds at home that you can use, you may use them too. So here I'm gonna start first is I have a bag of pinto beans. Yes, that's upside down. So if you look, these seeds have like little speckles on them. They're kind of cool. Um, so they, right now they're not growing anything. It's just a plant. I don't even know if they're going to grow. I don't know, but it's just, it's just a little, it's like a seed. So it's, it's tiny. It's about the size of my, you can see in my hand there. It's like the, about the size of my finger. Okay. The next seed I have is a sunflower seed. Now let's look how these look. These might look a little bit different. Let me draw them out here so you can see what they look like. Oh, so there they're. These are tiny sunflower seeds. They're just little black. That sounds like a gray color. Again, they're tiny. If you can see to my nail, it's very tiny there, okay? So those are sunflower seeds. I'm gonna slide them over here next to the other sunflower package. I have a pack of uh, beans. These are like almost like green beans, okay? So let's see what these look like. Oh, they sound like there's a lot in there. Oh, what color are they? Oh my, those are white, white. And again, they're almost like the pinto bean. See the pinto bean? And then there's the sunflower seed, or the, I'm sorry, the green bean seed. So I'm gonna put these seeds over here. I also have watermelon seeds, a big watermelon. Now let's see, now you should know what they look like from eating watermelon. Now these are all dried up. These were in a container, if I can get them to come out. Here they come. So these are sunflower seeds. Um, they look almost like the the sunflower, I'm sorry, watermelon seeds. These almost look like the sunflower seed. Kind of same thing, but sunflower seeds a little bit smaller than the watermelon. Okay, so those are the watermelon seeds. And the last seed I have is a pumpkin seed. Pumpkin seeds. So if you remember what they look like from when we had pumpkins before, they're big. Um, again, they're white. Now some of these are a little brownish color. They must be younger seeds. All right, so I'm gonna slide them back over here. And what I did was, is I have a bag. And in my bag, I have them marked. I wrote, I wrote five bags and I marked them on here. So I marked, this is the pinto bean. Inside my bag is just a wet paper towel. I just took a wet paper towel, I kind of drenched it off. And I'm gonna put in each bag, just that one seed. So this one I said pinto seeds or pinto beans. So I'm gonna take three or four pinto beans and I'm going to place them next to this wet cloth inside my bag. They may fall down to the bottom. I'll put like three, maybe four. I'll put four seeds in there. Okay, and we'll see what happens. Um, so I'm gonna put them in there and I'm gonna seal my bag nice and shut. I'm gonna make sure all the air is out of it and I'm gonna seal that shut, okay? And then I'm gonna get my next bag is gonna be my sunflower seed. So same thing here. I have my bag, I'm gonna open that up and I'm gonna put, oh, these are tough to pick up. I'm gonna put a couple of sunflower seeds. Now, I don't know if anything's gonna happen to these. Um, we're gonna try, we're gonna see what happens, but I don't know, so nothing may happen at all. Something might happen. Um, and, all right, I have three in there for the sunflower seeds. They're tough to pick up. All right, and then I'm gonna get my bean, my green bean bag, okay. I'll add three or four green beans to this one. So let's see, we got some beans there. I have three, maybe I'll add another one. Okay. And again, it's just a wet paper towel, it's a damp, not real, real overly wet. Okay, again, gonna put the water out of the, or the air out of there and close that bag. I have, the next bag is my watermelon bag. I'm gonna put these in. All right, let's get one or two more here. These seeds are tiny. The watermelon seeds are tough to pick up, but we're gonna try here. All right, and we have, okay, so we can see that baggie. I have them in there. Again, I'm gonna seal it, make sure the air is out of it. And the last seed I didn't put in was my pumpkin seed. So inside the pumpkin bag, I'm gonna put a couple of these seeds in here. Let's put them, put them in there. Perfect. Okay, sorry. It took me a minute there. All right, so I have these seeds in. I have the bags all sealed. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to take them to a window in my house that gets a lot of sunlight. 
So I'm then going to take them to the window. I'm gonna put a little bit of tape at the top and tape them and just hang them on my window. So they'll just kind of hang like this uh, with the sun shining out, okay? Tape that to your window and you're not gonna do anything with it. You're just gonna watch it. We're gonna see what happens. We're gonna see if anything grows. Um, will the plant grow in the bag? I don't know, because we know we need dirt for things to grow. But let's just try and we're gonna observe it. And every day I'll kind of videotape for you and show you what's going on. I'm probably gonna hang these in my basement because that my basement window gets a lot of sun. You want a window that you might get some sunlight because we know plants need sun to grow, okay? So um, I don't think it matters which way. Well, you might wanna keep the, keep the seed inside so we see the seed. Um, and just hang the, the wet towel can be towards the outside of the window. But I'll keep checking back with you and I'll show you what happens each day to my, my seeds. So let's see what happens. All right, bye boys and girls.